There will be work cut out for the G7 leaders on dealing with issues as President Biden juggles multiple international challenges and deals with his main political challenger here at home. Without naming his predecessor, President Biden jabbed at former President Donald Trump as Trump is scheduled to meet via Zoom with his probation officer today. Likely voters say that guilty verdict pales in comparison to other issues like the economy, inflation and the border. Joe Biden truly wanted to sign an executive order to stop the invasion. Right now, all he needs to do is say, I hereby immediately reinstate every single border policy of a gentleman named Donald J. Trump. New CBS News polling out today shows a likely rematch between Biden and Trump neck and neck, with the former president ahead by 1% nationally and President Biden ahead by 1% in the battleground states.